I think the kind of code would work faster before the divorce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's it's because it's from the school level, you know what I mean? From the school level. So you all both support the return of the core? Uh, well, um, when the core was there, it was there. I mean, you know, it was, it was a different time. Yeah. Now, I'm not so sure. Them young kids, man, how do you look at them? I mean, compared to those kids of all time, man. I know, man. Kids no worry, no worry. No respect. Kids no worry. No respect. No understanding. They don't listen to nothing at all. You try to tell them something good for themselves, and when you do check, kids no worry. They tell them what kind of thing now. Very good for anybody. What kids no want to do? That's it. That's what it. I know. What kids no want to do is 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 start having what they shouldn't have before they before they supposed to have it. They want to be independent before they finish school, they want to be in the drug scene, they want to stay out late in the I night. find there's uh, a lot of blue movies on television. Uh, yeah, no, yeah, man. I saw some TV movies, some movies on TV, man. That you they have a fun fashion. They have a problem there. That's right. Yeah. They have a problem there. We have a TV, we expose you to TV, and we just say, we're going to start doing that thing. We, we, yeah, we, we, yeah, we, and compare with the states. You cannot do that. The states were over you know, because from time they born, they get the support. And we I'm, saying, I'm, I'm saying, I'm saying, we, 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 we cannot compare the United States and America. Like, no, I see, and we I cannot westernize, um, like Americanize our, 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 our traditional thinking. Our thinking, you know? I see certain young girls at least walking now. Yo! No. Okay, alright. Anytime you see wings. Sir, uh, Etienne, Mr. Etienne, what's your full name? You're related. And it's Thursday, October 15th, 1998, my Dominic vacation, and Ms. Dickens has a very nice shop. And I just bought from her the uh, new Carry Malt, which is a Dominican-made beverage, non-alcoholic. And she has Miss Um. Aiden, tell me. I see you've got some liquor on the um on the shelf. Can you tell me what it is in the what's in the first bottle on the left? That first one is Puev. Okay. Um, Wabade. Wabade. Right. That one is just the plain casserole. Right. That one is with cinnamon. Right. That one is Annie. Right. And we have that one, Lapset. Lapset. Always take a, a shot of it to drink in the morning for bad stomach. Wow. <laughs> and this is Mr. Etienne. <laughs> yes. But you've got a very handsome husband there. Can you can you guys hug for me? Let me see you hug. Sure. That's good. You've got a very nice store, sir. <laughs> and uh, I am just pleased to be here as your guest and having some of your uh, carry malt and getting an explanation as to the different drinks. Alcoholic drinks, yeah. and so this is put together by your store. Eh? You you yes, you yes. add the different things to the rum, yes. and that gives it different flavors. Different flavors yes. Wonderful, wonderful. Well, you know you've done a wonderful job here. Um, I just realized I had you out of focus. Hug again for me because I, I didn't have you focused properly. I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> oh, that makes a nice picture. I need to put on a magazine or something. <laughs> <laughs> so how long have you been? Uh, how long have you had the store? Um, it's a boss. Maybe 20 years now. 20 years, that's good. And you built it, you just developed, built a house. Yeah. And I see you got Bob Marley all over the place. And you're on the way from the airport, huh? So you've been here for 20 years, and do you get tourists and so on? Well, yes, they always pass, on the, but they usually pass more on the other side. Okay. The Imperial Road. For seventeen dollars, what is in that bottle right next to the soca rum? Is that a Dominican rum? Uh, no, that is from Saint Lucia. It's a um, peanut punch. Oh, it's a peanut punch. Yes, from Saint Lucia. Okay, how much is it? Seventeen dollars. Hmm. And that is our soca rum, made in Dominica. Okay, and you have the um, Barbadie rum. 
Is it okay if I come down, Mama, and take some pictures? Uh, with my dad. Do you see yourself in the picture? Yeah. Okay, so what class are you in? Grade one. That's grade one? Okay, and I want you all to tell me your names, right? Starting from the first row. What's your name? What's your name? Yeah. 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 What's your name? Where's your shirt? It's wet. It's wet? Yeah. Oh, you can't have a wet shirt. Okay, what's your name on the back? What's your name right here, little girl? What's your name? What's your name? What's your name right here? What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? And here you've got a very beautiful teacher. Teacher, what's your name? Miss Esprit. Miss Esprit, nice to meet you. Where did you go to school, Miss Esprit? Why you know Esprit? When? I went to school. I taught there from 19... I know, Miss Esprit. You know me then? Come on, come and shake my hand then. Come, come, I taught you. When did you graduate? In 1985. That's right. I taught you, didn't I? Yes, I that, remember. But of course. Don't be shy. I mean, you know, that's good. Um, what's the name of your school? Ben. 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 Okay, great. And you're Miss Esprit? Yep. What did I teach you? I taught her. I taught her at school. I was her teacher. <laughs> what's your name? Bernard. Bernard, how old are you? <laughs> how old are you, Bernard? How old is he? 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 How old Dear George. Dear George? <laughs> you tell it. Okay, guys. I know this guy behind here. Oh, and what's that little girl's name over here? Elisha. Come, what's your name? Shake my hand. Look at that. Look at that. You all look very beautiful. You like my name. What's your name, pal? Great. Bye bye. Say bye bye, guys. Bye bye. Bye bye. I love you. You gotta say I love you too. Take care, guys. Bye bye. Bye bye. Take care. Uh, this is the principal here. Okay, principal. Bye bye. What's your name, ma'am? A uh, Gabriel Christian. Nice to meet you. I taught Miss Esprit at the grammar school back in the day. Yeah, but she was a little shy. She, I recognize the face though. You've got some very nice. Time is over. Okay. What's the name of the school, principal? Okay, but you're a senior teacher, I assume. You're doing a good job and you've got some nice students. Okay, bye. Yes, bye-bye. Yeah, my name is Greg. Greg? Yes. Okay. Andrew. Okay. Yeah. Nice and to I meet you. I work in Stonefield. Stonefield? I'm farming, yeah. Good for you, man. Keep it up, right? Yeah, you too. Peace and love, man. Okay. Bernie. Bruni. Bruni. Yes. Andrea, can you, can you describe how hibiscus juice is made? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just go ahead and tell me how you make it.
you dry the high biscuits, you put hot water in it, then you put it in ginger, and then you strain it, and then you sweeten it. Hello, how are you? I'm just taking some photographs. Is this self in there? Okay, um, let me go over this way. Is this where I, the cashier is? The cashier. The cashier. Yeah. Okay. Hi there. How are you? Hello, how are you? You're Hermina, right? <laughs> <laughs> Name's Gabriel Christian, I was over at RSL. You're what? Uh, Gabriel Christian, I was over at Room RSL. I, um, I just want to pay for the uh, meal. The uh, room was uh, gratis. I don't know. Do you remember that time when he was Prime yeah. Minister? How old were you then? How old were you? Well, I guess you were like quite a teenager at the time, right? Oh, yes, yes. Where did you go to school? Me? <laughs> Private Foundation High School. Okay, some record. Why are you putting your hands there? Administration at the Don Lincoln Festival Commission. Really, what's your last name? Um, oh, what's your first name? Cynthia Ely. And uh, you were talking about a program you saw last night with a stranger or something? No, so, well, I didn't know who the person was, and then I asked my boyfriend, Do you know me? Because we came to our office and I didn't know you were a lawyer. I see. And then he told me he went to school together with you and you were very good at classroom, so I was like, I was asking the girl. Okay. <laughs> sure. What's your uh, boyfriend's name? Uh, Phil Bertrand. Phil Bertrand. Yeah, he's a Oh man, we went to uh, mixed school together. His father was a uh, fire chief or something. Yeah, yeah. He's a police officer, I think. Yeah. Uh, both of the it is Phil Bert and Phil. Phil. Are they both fire, uh, police officers? Yes, yeah, but Okay, he's no longer a police officer. No, I think he resigned. Jeff Freeman, a nice one, man. Well, what do you what, What's up, comrade? Good to oh, see you. Oh, no, I covered you on the TV last night, boy. Well, I hope I didn't uh, disappoint my teacher. You know, he taught me uh, catechism. Yeah. <laughs> Jeff Freeman. <Yeah. laughs> my catechism teacher, man. Can you imagine that to me? Can you imagine that was a catechism? So from a priest to a man. Can you imagine that? I don't know, a priest or a holy boy. Alright, I'm just having a buzzer with the radios. 
So you yeah. run your own business now? Yeah, I run my own business now. We celebrate my 11th anniversary okay. this month. So, uh, Jeffrey, what, what is it you, you, you okay. sell and what do right. you do? Right. I know you've been very involved in the community because I've seen you in several programs. Yeah, well, I've, I've been trying to play my fair share in the community. Mr. Tula has me, Isa has me working hard for the Creole Festival and then right. I'm involved in Carnival. I'm the right. president You're the of the for Carnival. I'm the chairman for Carnival. I heard Jeff say. I'm the Rotary president. I heard, I heard, I heard Jeff say if you got to a death man of Carnival, man, when you have a band playing crazy like a wild ass in no zone, man, if you want to spread your back, somebody else. That's a shoot out of the media. I said that. I said when we had a, a open a death party, I said everybody should go in their backyard and have a a barbecue in their backyard for Carnival and close Rosa Monday and Tuesday. Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> so that's just to call me backyard barbecue. Backyard barbecue. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, it's good to see you, man. Yeah. And uh, your wife is more involved in the business than me. Is. Okay, well, uh, have you got my pineapple farmer, man? Okay, so you're saying you do, you also do some farming as well? Yeah, do some farming. 
trying to do a project with 45,000 yeah, pineapple yeah. plants. Okay, wonderful. Yes, wonderful. And, uh, yeah. If things go well, the cruise ship should be supplied with it. That's great. We sent, um, we sent our first shipment to France with, with Dexter when they were going for the program. What is it? Fa 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 Grand Pavoir. Grand Pavoir. Okay, and that's wonderful. Ms. Burnaby gave us an excellent quality rating. Okay. And she said, just a pity that the, the quantities are so small. Yes, yes. But yes. Um, she said the, the people came back asking, where did yes, that come yes. from? Okay, so that's one of so the well. things are looking up. Well, I look forward to yeah. Wonderful. And what's your dad's name? Wonderful. You know, your dad and my older brother went to school together, and your grandmother taught me at mixed school when I was about... How old are you now? How old are you now? I am eight. Oh, I was younger than you when your grandmother taught me. She taught me when I was about six, seven. Yeah. So, which school do you go to now? Which school? Mm -hmm. I go to St. Martin Primary School. And what subjects are your best subjects? Mm -hmm. Grammar, math, and math, and craft. Wonderful. So, what would you like to be when you grow up? When I grow up, I like to be a nurse. You like to be a nurse? Yeah. That's very nice. I'm sure your your dad will be very proud. And Akima, who is this guy who's sitting right there eating some bread? My brother Sherwin. Your brother Sherwin? Yeah. How many brothers and sisters do you have? Two brothers, no sisters. Okay, so you're the only girl? Yeah. So where's your other brother? My other brother is in New York studying. Wonderful, wonderful. Do you know what he's studying? No. Sherry, come over here, man. You can't run away from the interviewer, man. Do you know this guy here, Uncle Eddie? Yes. Tell me about Uncle Eddie. What does Uncle Eddie do? Uh, um, just you, uh, I don't know. Okay. Sherry, tell me about this stuff. Where do you go to school? Um, SMA. SMA? SMP? SMP. Okay, so what, 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 what form are you in now? Third form. Third form, how old are you now? Third form. Okay, and what are your best subjects? Um, English, history. What, would you, what would you like to do when you get out of uh, huh? SMA? What is that? What would you like to do when you get out of SMA? Um, what would you like to do when you get out or when you graduate from the uh, SMA? I'm not really sure, I'm a mechanic. A mechanic? Okay, this is what you're going to have to do because remember, the chemo was pretty clear as to what you wanted to do, so uh, your chemo has a little edge on you, right? So what you want to make sure you do is you prepare yourself mentally by reading a lot to kind of figure out, you know? Because your family is one that's really based on excellence, right? So your dad, I'm sure, wants good results, right? So if you want to be a mechanic, you have to make sure you're the best mechanic that there can be, right? Okay, great. Well, nice to meet you. And nice to meet you, your chemo. All right. Eight years old, a student at St. Martin's Primary School. And Chantel, what are you going to do for us this evening? Okay, why don't you lower down the television so I can hear it? You want to lower it down? Okay, Chantel, go ahead. Lower it, lower it, After three, yeah? One, two, three. Oh, Dominica, how beautiful. <laughs> they are mm. Oh, Dominica, how beautiful. Lush, green, and refreshing. Land of rivers, mountains, and a people so hospitable. Whitey Kuguri, how sweet, so natural, so pure, almost asleep, yet full of vigor. Carrots, exotic fruit. Sissy Parrot, and we're watching too a pop crew with experiences. Dominica is priceless. Ecotourism is the best. Dominica is real. It's truly the Caribbean place. Whoa, wonderful, 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 wonderful. Wow, very good. Hi, good evening, Mrs. Coffee. This is Gabriel Christian. Nice to meet you. Yeah, pleased to meet you. Yeah, absolutely, I've heard very good things about you. And you have very yes, nice children, of that's course. Good, that's Weissman good. has always said the best about you, and I, <laughs> I uh, of course, have just experienced the Akima's uh, literary yes, skill. You were in good hands. So, what do you do, Miss Coffee? Me, I'm hmm. an accounts clerk. I see. With that. Home industry. Okay, okay. Are you from, Ar are you from Argan? Yes. 
I'm from Westley. From Westley, okay. You didn't ask? You knew that? Like no, no. The twang. Yeah. I just hear the twang. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. I'm from Westley. Good, good. Yeah. So you've got that some is, nice um, your right brother's name. name. Um, you Dr. Benji? Yes. That's his sister. You oh. know Benji, right? Yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Benji. You studied in Cuba? Yes, yes, yeah. man. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes, Griffin. Yes, yes. yes. Neko. Yes. Doctor. Yes. He's a doctor now. Yeah. Yes. Is he here? He's in Jamaica. He called tonight, you know, mm. when told him you were coming here. Yeah. Right, 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 yeah. right, yeah. right. right. Yeah. Absolutely, man. Absolutely. Uh -huh. It's really nice to meet you and family and Welcome. thank you for welcoming us. So as we have a tourist ship in Porter. Is that is that a boat in port? Well, is the boat there? Yeah, um, yeah. That's the boat at the way from. If it's a tourist ship, it, it, it looks kind of well. It looks yeah. kind of small, though, but I guess. Okay. So this is Rose on the distance. Yeah, but it looks close, doesn't it? Very man. Yeah, Although what we yeah, see, yeah, what we yeah. see in there is mostly King's Hill, though. King's Hill. Yes, and this is Brother Arrow yes, coming up there. Okay. Yeah. And we're in the uh, wall house area. We're in the wall house area. And that's the. Uh, these are the homes of the elite. <laughs> <laughs> I was laughing at that. Yeah, yeah, I have to. <laughs> Indeed, certainly. Yeah. So, you're Kima. Hello. Good Good Hello. 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 You wear glasses now? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Right. Well, that's still not much of time. Here we have Alvin Bernard, one of our uh, senior economists, plotting survival strategy for the economy of Dominica <laughs> and uh, pleased to have him and as we made commentary early we made comment early on his amazing physical shape man that he has uh, seemed uh, caught within a time warp man <laughs> 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 and Mr. Coffee yeah. how was England? So which part of England were you? I was in Paddington. Paddington. Paddington Station. That's West London Territory. That's our territory. That's where from land originates from. That's what we did. So what did you do in England, sir? I used to car carpentry there. Carpentry, wonderful. I, I used to work in the, in the hospital. Maintenance. What? Maintenance, that's wonderful. Mm -hmm. So you are uh, visiting or you in St. Mary's? Is that St. Mary's St. Mary's. Yeah. Okay. Pritt Street. You want on yeah, Pritt Street, right? Yeah, right, right. right. I, 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 How long you in England for a while? Five years. Five Five years. That's right, that's right. That's the other thing. Okay. Because uh, you went to London, right? right? Yeah. 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 London and Wales. Okay. You live last week. Wales is where the Masters. I was paid at the master, right? Yeah, I was no, I'm not the Okay, but you're the undergrad at London. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's I had it. So my, my degree was in Wales University. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, twenty. And that's economics, yeah. huh? Yeah. Development yeah. studies. Yeah. Okay, good, good. Yeah. Development yeah. studies. Yeah. So how was that? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's the first time I've spoken to you about that. You know. Yeah, uh, well, you you mess up my eyes with that thing. He may look good, but he's getting blind. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. And Mr. So. Scoffy, did you also work at St Mary's University? I mean, hospital. <laughs> no, I worked. In, who was living on you? Yeah, he lived in Arnhem, yeah. I work in this school in, in Oakington Road. Oh, yeah? Primary, um, yeah, West yeah, yeah. Primary School uh, Community. Oh, so you know, you know CC then? CC Melanie. CC, we call her. Uh, what's her first Roberts. Uh, she's from Montjoy. No. She lives on that little road. If you, if you say Oakington Road, she just lives on the corner from Chippenham. CC. CC, I, I call her CC. She's is God brother to us. Show me now. You came up? Okay, show me your mathematics book. Show your math book. It's on your right, it's in your right hand. Let me see any any papers that you have. Boy, last night, boy, I must see, boy, that was a great thing, my friend, you reach out to the boy, I died so, so many times. I know, I know, I suppose, I was waiting for the brothers to come back to call it. So many times that I can't get through. Okay. All right, so this is six over six. This is six over six. 
Okay, and turn the page. Wow, this is very good. Everything is right. Whoa, everything is right. Akima, you're doing very well. Look. You're doing very well here. Whoa, everything is right.